It's sexy, it's expensive, and it's perhaps the finest lens ever built. The Zeiss Otis 85mm f1.4 APO Planar T-Star. Look at that thing. I mean, come on. One is spherical element plus six anomalous partial dispersion elements, some of which even f***ing float. The pride of Germany, even if it is made in Japan. I went to the Photokina Trade Fair this year, otherwise known as the biannual convention for people who suffer from gas. I owned a bunch of different cameras, but the only ones I had with me at the show were my retro-chic iPhone 3GS and this thing. The Sony RX100. Not the 3, not the 2, but the original. Peeling, multi-coatings and all. So we've got the Sony A7R with the Metabones adapter and the Zeiss Otis 85mm 1.4 beauty. Up against what is using, using to be, or what's being used to record this, the Sony RX100. So, the first shot will be at 2.8 and the second shot will be at F8. So, let's see how it works. Thank you. <laughs> a serious test such as this one requires a serious test target. Bingo. Exactly what I was looking for. While a Zeiss engineer and a spectator helped me navigate the German menus on the A7R, I looked for a subject. The shrub. That one. Now where the hell is the self-timer? 